Hello there pluggers, Ivasaur Figure again with you. Uh, thanks very much for joining me for uh, another guitar lesson. This is a classic song from uh, Elton John, a really nice song. This called Sorry Seems to Be the Hardest Word. Normally associated obviously with the piano, but uh, I think it goes over to the guitar really, really nicely. It's uh, got some nice chords in it and a lovely, very, very nice melody. Okay, So I thought it would make a good lesson. Okay. Um, Standard tuning, no capos as you can see. Uh, I'm playing it in the key of E minor. Uh, the original Elton John version I believe was in G minor. So if you want to play along with a very early Elton John version you'd have to put a capo on the third fret and then play along with, with everything I'm about to play with a capo on the third fret and it should be good to go. Okay. So without more ado I'm going to uh, play and croak my way through uh, most of the song. I'm just going to omit the, uh, the instrument a bit, okay? And then I'm going to break it down and show you how I played it. So here we go. <clears throat> So, um, I say, right, so let's do the intro to start with. And uh, basically, uh, it starts off with a C, arpeggiated, just sort of five down to one. Then we play a partial B seventh chord, okay? And that's basically first fret of the fourth string, second fret of the third, and second fret of the first string, okay? Four chord, and all you're interested in is strings four, three, two, and one. Okay, just something like that. Okay, then we play a partial G chord. All you need is one finger on the third fret of the first st string. Okay, again, first four strings, just up and down. Really. Okay, so so far we've got this. play uh, a 
an A7, but not the usual A7. <laughs> it's first finger on the uh, second fret of the fourth string, and third finger is on the fourth fret of the fifth string. And you should end up with a chord playing strings five down to one. It should sound like this. Okay? And again, so what's what you do? You actually just... Just go from down, from five down to one, and then sort of you know, work your way up a couple of strings, okay? There's no particular... Something like that, okay? So from the beginning, it's... Okay, let me go back to the C. Straight from five down to one. And then we do a little run. Uh, there's a little bit of a pause, and then there's a, a run down. You play open fifth with the second on the fourth. Then you put your finger over to the third on the sixth, third fret of the sixth string, and then hit that second on the fourth again. So you've got. Okay? So, so far we've got. to the two chords which you'll find all the way through the song. <laughs> the first one is one chord an F sharp diminished seventh. <laughs> Don't be frightened. It's very simple really. Uh, basically bar the fourth, third and second strings with your first finger on the first fret. Okay. Then put your third finger onto the second fret of the third string. Okay. And you'll second finger on the second fret of the sixth string okay and just play the sixth string the fourth string third string and second string okay. got that and then we so that's all you just play those six four four three and two and then play a b seventh standard b seventh end up on that top first string, okay? So with an up, usually an up stroke. Right. Okay? So, from the beginning, slowly. slowly coming up okay okay so that's the intro and we go into the verse, and um, basically it starts off on E minor. What have I got to do to make you A minor 7th? So it's A minor with an open 3rd string, okay? Two fingers. So E minor, what have I got to do to make you A minor 7th? Help me. D. What have I got to do to make you G? Care. And then you've got those two chords again, the F sharp minor, uh, F sharp diminished seventh, and the B seventh. That comes in a lot, so practice those two together because you need it. Okay, so from the beginning, E minor, what are you going to do to make me A minor seventh? Love me, D, what have I got to do to make me care? G, those two together, the F sharp diminished seventh, B seventh. E minor again. What do I do in lightning? A minor seventh strikes me. D. And I wait to find that you're not G. There. Then the F sharp diminished seventh again. B seventh. Okay. And then into the second verse, which is exactly the same as the first verse. So, what have you got to do to make you A minor seventh? D. 
party What are you going to do to be G heard? F sharp diminished 7th and B7 E minor What have you got to do when it's all A minor 7th? All over, sorry D Sorry Seems to be the hardest G word F sharp diminished 7th and B7 so that's the verse it's taken care of. So once through at normal speed, okay? Da 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 E minor to E minor seventh. D da 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 G F sharp infinite seventh and B seventh. E minor da 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 A minor seventh da 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 to D. G word. F sharp diminished seventh and B seventh. Right, now we go into the chorus, okay? C. So sad. Now this is where the intro comes in, because this is partially the intro, okay? So C. It's sad. Partial diminished, just like the intro. So sad. G. Partial G. It's sad, sad. A seventh. Situation, okay? C. And it's getting B seventh more and more absurd. Okay, so we just go through that bit again. So just like the intro, C. It's sad. B uh, B seven partial. So sad partial G. It's a sad sad A seventh part. Just like the intro, C. It's more and more B seven absurd, absurd E minor absurd. And then we do the F sharp diminished seventh and the B seventh again. Okay. The e, and then we do the C again. C sad partial B seventh da, da, to G just like the intro. Da, 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 A seventh situation back to C. This leaves to me slight pause. Then the rundown just like the intro. F sharp diminished seventh and B seventh. So once through the uh, chorus in one go, okay? So coming out of the verse, second verse, uh, with the old F sharp diminished seventh and B seventh. C, it's sad, B seventh, so sad. G, da 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 da, A seventh, where should C, da da B seventh, da 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 da, F sharp diminished seventh and B seventh. C, so sad, B7, B, G, da, da, C, uh, B, A7, sorry, C, it seems to be, run down, F sharp diminished sevens and B7, others, one, then we go into the last verse, well the way I did it anyway, D, just like an all first verse to start with, what I have to do, to make E minor to A minor seventh, D. What are you going to do to be G? F sharp diminished and B7. E minor. What do I got to do when lightning A minor 7 strikes me? Now, this is a bit of a tricky bit, okay? F sharp diminished 7. What do I got a B7? A mi e minor. Oh, just let me stop that. I'll be right back. Sorry, I'm back again. <laughs> I forgot I left the timer running. Okay, so we just go from that um, that bit again where it goes um, where it goes. Uh, what I got to do when lightning strikes me? Right, F sharp diminished seventh. What have I got a B seventh do? E minor. What have I got a A minor seventh do? F sharp minus diminished seventh again. What have I got F, B7 to when so and sorry seems to be those words. Okay, so we do that again. So from the beginning of this last verse, what are you going to do to make me love me? D, what are you going to do? G, G, F sharp diminished seventh from B7, B e minor, what are you going to do when lightning A minor seventh strikes me? 
Now the S sharp diminished seventh of B7. What have I got a B7? E minor. What have I got A minor seventh to do? F sharp minus the seventh. What but sorry seems to be seventh. The hardest word. B7. G. A7. C. Just like the intro. Pause. Run down. F sharp diminished seventh. B7. E minor. Second string to fourth fret and back to the fifth fret. Oh no, sorry, sorry, no, just fifth fret to fourth fret, sorry. And then th on the first string, third fret to second fret, and then up to the eighth fret to the seventh fret, and then twelfth fret to eleventh fret, back to the twelfth fret. Do it. Yeah, and strum on the E minor, whatever. You know, it's just something to nicely finish it off, okay? So the last verse again, just to make sure we got this clear, okay? So E minor. What do I do? A minor seventh and low. D. What have I got to do? To B G. F sharp diminished seventh and B seventh. E minor. What have I got to do? When do I? The A minor seventh. F sharp and minus 7th and B7 What have I got to do? E minor and A minor 7th What have I got to do? F sharp minus 7th seven. When sorry seen B7 says it be the hardest E minor word B7 partial B G A7th C Quick pause and then run down F sharp minus minus seventh and B seven to E minor. Something like that. Well, hopefully you'll make some sense out of that. <laughs> Sorry about the break in the middle for my timer. I forgot I left it running. Anyway, uh, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks very much for watching. Bye for now. Bye bye.